Okay, sorry it's getting got, uh, dark, guys, but I guess a uh, good time to utilize my kitty ears. <laughs> That's the headset that I've got for now. I thought it was cute. Um, anyway, they, they flash, too. Check them out. And for anybody that likes these, you know, because I'm poor folk, I got them for all of $10 at my local family dollar store. But they change LED lighting pace. Anyway, um, so I want to take a minute. Um, I got an astonishing number of subscribers just recently, and most of you have been very kind. I want to welcome you here, first off. Um, thank you so much for, you know, joining me. Um, with that said, there's, there's some important facts that I just need to let y'all know about because I was utilizing my channel to journal in regards to my Morgellons journey. Um, then it got to where I kind of was sharing a lot of my personal stuff. And, you know, there for a while I was trying to follow the alternative media until it just got, you know, to be too much and just too much negativity from people. So then, because of my health and the battle with Morgellons and Lyme, um, along with depression, anxiety, ADHD, and some memory loss issues, I started to apply some of the teachings I was learning from Abraham Hicks and just applying the powers of positivity. And so, because doctors are failing me concerning the Lyme and the Morgellons, um, in order to get treatment, and because I'm already an individual with a disability due to several extensive back surgeries, and when I say several, I mean several. I'm like part bionic woman. I've got equipment in me, have had, I've got cages, I've got titanium cages, I have a spinal cord stimulator, I've been through, oh, five or six, um, to be exact. And so, with that said, I just want to give you all a little bit of my history here so that you all know if I'm not as on top of things as you all would like, to please be patient with me, first off, because I don't just solely do, you know, alternative media anymore. But if that's, you know, where I'm at in that moment, and I'm, I'm doing some research, and I feel like it's something you guys want to hear, I'm going to share it with you all. Just like I share from my Sing app here on Smule, which, for any of you interested, it's a karaoke app. Super fun. Most people here are awesome. Um, kind people. Um, it is a karaoke app. Some people give you synthetic. Some people are rude. But there's plenty of us nice ones here. It, you know, and I've got my good and bad days, so I'm not here to judge anybody for their singing. It is a karaoke app. Um, so any of you that would like to sign up to Smule, it's a great place to be if you're looking for some fun. Um, but anyhow, so I was approaching things with the positivity. I was doing my singing, sharing all that, and then I got back onto the research again. And there's times that you guys make it real hard to be a truther because you know, if you don't know these things about me, especially for those of you just joining, which I'm going to try to be, you know, forgiving there because I know that the one person I haven't even got through all the messages that was being rude is most likely a new follower that doesn't know a lot of my backdrop. But still, you got to understand when dealing with people that not all of us are bad people and that's not our intent. I'm not trying to ever spread this information, and I'm a good character with a good heart. It's not my intention. I'm trying to show love and support here, share the truth, get the truth out to you guys the best I can despite my own struggles. Not to mention, I, you know, I'm also helping the ex out best I can. My daughter's back, and there's a lot of negative energies that surround that, that I'm already, despite my anxiety and depression factors and stuff, and the more gowns and everything that I, I'm trying to stay grounded, focused, and positive throughout it all because it's important to my health, because it's important to spread good, loving, positive energy, not just for me, but for everybody. So I do not and will not welcome negativity on my feed. If you're one of those that want to call us with more gallons crazy, then my feed is not for you because I will not sit here and be insulted. Do not add insult to injury to a Morgallons victim because it is a horrible nightmare of affliction and I can only pray it doesn't affect anybody else. You know, those that aren't already. So, um, but with that said, you know, just please be patient with me and I do um, have a lot of issues between my notifications 
Um, it seems like if you share it directly below a YouTube video, then I will, in fact, get it. You know, it's just a matter of me playing catch up, you know? And if I don't reply, I'll at least try to hit the like button, acknowledge your comment, unless I, you know, what you said just really didn't impress me much, or you know what I mean? But I, I'll try to at least hit the like button for you guys, and if I, I really like it, I'll, I'll hit the love button for you. But, um, you know, in order to communicate effectively, I guess what I'm saying here is please make sure you're not in my spam folder or nothing. Make sure you comment directly down in the YouTube, you know, underneath the YouTube video. If I'm disorganized about things, I mean, I'm sorry. I am simply doing the best I can despite my own personal stuff. So just please know that. And if you don't like that and you want somebody better organized, well, then I'm not the channel for you. Because I'm not out to gain followers, but I'm here to, you know, be honest with you. I'm not going to put up with any negativity. If you're going to be negative and rude, like I said, this is my health we're talking about because I can't get treatment. So it's important for me to maintain some positivity, okay? And I can't do that with a bunch of negativity. I can't get better with, you know, negative energy surrounding me constantly, not only here at home, but when I get on the internet as well. That's something I cannot handle, I will not do. So if you're one of those rude negative people, kindly remove yourself and don't let the door hit you on the butt on the way out. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna put it as nicely as I can because I will not condone that here. But for the rest of you, you good, kind, loving people, um, you truth seekers, you know, all you trying to, you know, get things straight just like I am going down this rabbit hole and learning that our, our reality is stranger than fiction, our holographic reality is stranger than fiction, then please stay with me. Um, and let's get this show on the road. So much love and welcome to all of you. Y'all take care. God bless.